Double Dragon. It's your boy A-Man. Like Back with some new heat for y'all today. You heard what she said. Let's get it, man. As y'all know, second video of this crazy arc. A lot of stuff is being displayed. Yes, sir. I need some more answers. Big facts. You know what I'm saying? This, hey, white beard is cold, bro. I ain't even gonna boost. But the whole story we just found out, the past, the white beard, Ace, was beautiful. Um, even found out that Ace is uh the son of Goldie Roger, which I was saying we mentioned that back in the uh, old episode. I went back and watched that, and I was like, "That's crazy!" I was, I was like, "Wow!" So, how yeah, you? So. I didn't ask you this the last episode, huh? I didn't ask you this the last episode. What? How do you feel about Ace being the cause of all of this? Technically Blackbeard, but how you feel about Ace? Ace just running out like that and causing all of this. I felt being that he's like your favorite character. He one of my faves, but I felt that uh I didn't like that he did I didn't like that he disobeyed Whitebeard. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I didn't want Ace to do that. I felt kinda bad actually. I was like, dang. But at the same time, it's sometimes what you fighting for too that count. And he was saying he disrespected his pop's name and he was willing to fight for that no matter what. Mm -hmm. So I respected that part. But like I said, you know, white beer, your pop say chill, bro. Like, dang, bro. You gotta chill. So I didn't yeah. like I didn't like I didn't I didn't like that though. But yeah. Yep, yeah, well White Bill showed up at the end of the day. Y'all I know y'all hating hating on me for not liking Gart. It's cool, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna speak my opinion no matter what. You know what I'm saying I don't mess with Gart right now. He got time to change my mind. But like I said, it don't matter what they do. If they your sons, you take on their burdens. And that's how I feel. And that's what White Beard showed. So I respect White Beard 100,000%. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, I'm ready to get to this stuff. You got any end, uh, starting remarks? I'm ready to see this heat. <laughs> he like, shut up, nigga. I, I'm, I'm, <laughs> hey, I'm going to have your speech. I'm good. I'm, I'm, hey, ain't nothing, ain't nothing over here. I'm good. I'm just ready to see what this damn power is. That's what I'm ready to see. Right, I, was, I was like, y'all heard him. You know what I'm saying? Right. I, I'm standing here by you, even though we're on opposite sides. I still got your back. All right. Can't Appreciate nobody do nothing to us. Appreciate you. Mm -hmm. Ready to get into it? Let's run it up. All right. Oh my god. I, I hope this ain't it. Okay. I hope this ain't it. Okay. This is a suck. Okay, stuff is lining up a certain way, right? You have Ace is already a, being accepted as a, a, a white beard pirate, right? Mm -hmm. But I don't think we got to the part where he is he is wanting to fulfill white beard's dream of being the king of pirates. I don't think he got to that point yet. Ace? Yes. Right now? Yes. Like, like yeah. not, not, not present. I'm talking about in the past. Oh yeah, yeah. So, what if he finds something out about Whitebeard? Like Whitebeard about to die soon or something because of the dialysis and stuff. Yeah. So he wants to fulfill his his what he sees as his true pops before he dream died. before he goes. What else can make this dude sad? We just guess it, bro. I'm just hoping that theory is not correct. But um, but like I said, they always kill all the strong people off with some freaking illnesses all the time. Yeah, that's true. The stupidest way, man. That yeah. would that would make like remember when I said um last time I was saying Ace was wanting to make him Whitebeard the King of Pirates to mm -hmm. replace his dad because he don't like his dad. Mm -hmm. and you were saying. You didn't really like that because it would mean like he was doing it for his own selfish intentions. Yeah, and like kind of trying to get at his dad. 
but like what you saying makes sense like that'll be like for your like for that um theory makes yeah. sense for you because it's like please somebody do something for somebody you care about yeah but um uh <sighs> it could be some both though i don't know i don't know but everything can't last forever i ain't gonna stunt this kind of remind me of power in a sense like he's technically uh ooh. <laughs> Bro, say you trying to be only, mad as freak, bro. Stop playing. Only because it's one fact. Only because it's one fact. Not fully Tyreek fail, but Tyreek fail. But look, this why. You lost me. You got Tyreke. Ghost, right? And you got Kanan. Kanan? You got Kanan, right? Whitebeard would be Kanan in a sense, right? You know, Ghost would be Goldie Roger. You know, Tyreek was more closer to Kanan because he hated his father so much. But it didn't flow. It didn't flow like that right. because of that. Because you know what I'm saying. Right. They met on different circumstances. But I agree with it, the. It was just it was just a weird connection. I was like, oh crap, that's crazy. This man. He's definitely not Ty- Tyreek is his own character, in his yeah. Tyreke's I mean, that last act H did was Tyreek ish. I'm not even finna say he when they. Hmm. Was it Tyreek ish though? Tyreek be on some simp stuff. He was doing. He be doing stuff. I um, never like. And- I can never respect anything Tyreek did. At all, yeah, I ain't saying everything, but actually, he listened to Kana. Everything Kana said, Tyreke yeah, he was listen. he was stupid poison. Like yeah. I, I kind of understand. Like I always like I understand when Ace and Luffy just go in full fledged. Mm-hmm. Like I would probably do the same thing, but just looking from an outside perspective, you'd be like, "Oh no, don't do that. It's kind of dumb." Yeah, yeah. But Tyreek, I just want to kill him. Honestly, Ace um, left eye is a little. It's a little cockeyed, a little shade. Maybe he's looking. Mm, yeah, I guess. Am I am I tripping? Um, I can see what you're saying. Close your saying. close your one. You use siren gun real quick. I used the wrong guy. <laughs> I can see what you're saying. He's not fully centered. Yeah, they yeah. need to make sure y'all center my uh, my character's eyes, bro. That's me. Hold up. Just the animation it's for real, bro. This, bro. Stop playing, bro. Oh, Attention sweet. to detail. He's like, he got less freckles on the left than the right. Wasn't he just doing the move? He just canceled it? Maybe they playing the sad music because Ace is finally realizing, like, they still came even after he disobeyed them. Mm-hmm. Like, like family stayed together. Yeah. Did, did, did he get the first version of Whitebeard Pirates logo? He's like, hey, Shade. I, got, I got the cra- trans version. You got that OG one. I wonder how strong Marco is compared to everybody. Like where he rank at? First first um first division commander? Mm. Prepare yourself, baby. Oh my god. <laughs> he got the he, that same color flower is uh as um Ace's uh mama. Mm. Boy, it was oh. Everybody wanna fight Whitebeard because they ganging up now. Ain't this some stuff, bro? Right. Everybody tough now. He said that's always. <laughs> I can't stand it. <laughs> She's like, where's my boo? But he is an exception. <laughs> Can't talk about her boo. Facts. I just hope Luffy don't come in here and mess up this 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 moment right now. It's kind of epic right now. I don't need him still in the shine. It's your show, it's fine. <laughs> Where's the water going? Oh, Even back there? Shoot. He's sending ships backwards, bro. He was holding on to his torso. Bro, this was power. Jimbei, come on, man. Jump in the water. And he know. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Whitebeard sees Blackbeard as his son too, wouldn't he? I wonder how that interaction gonna go when they meet. You mean after he killed him or when he see him for the first time? Mm. <laughs> I said, don't worry. <laughs> P Patty, are you gonna call out Weird Circle? <laughs> 
<laughs> At least he's starting to accept it. <laughs> this dude is like the hype man, fam. <laughs> Perfect composure. It's coming back. <laughs> He's like, I'm tired of his cap. I'll be the person like, I need to analyze everything the hell's going on. Mm -hmm. Still don't know who opened the gate for them, right? Mm -hmm. Is that a wave? Whatever white beard did is did is coming. Oh my god, Kobe. bro. I don't even like Kobe being here, bro. Yeah. Bro, white beard is ridiculous, bro. Hey, bro. Go for me, go tall as hell. Oh, see, I already knew. Bro, he could just do this on command. Trimmer, trimmer fruit. Edward Newgate, aka hey, Whitebeard, okay. Trimmer, Trimmer Fruit. Don't think that our superior force will guarantee you. He could well fail. Dang, he doubting? Destroy the world. Man, he can just break shit in it, bro. That's fitting. Ay, ay, ay. And once Ace get loose. Thought it's come Luffy messing it up. I'm about to say it just came on. It did make it seem like it was in there. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. They never had the narrator thing before right, the talking <laughs> in a mission. All right, we excited already, dang. Not a lot of people gonna survive this unless uh homeboy freeze it or something. Yeah. What's Sengoku? What's I? I didn't know what Sengoku power is and Goldie Raza power is. They're not even worried. <laughs> That's a little better. Dang, they just OP. Three versus three versus one. I still like the odds. I ain't worried. Ice Age. You <laughs> long, you young squirt. Hey, you already throwing Shot shots? What did he did just he say, do? Did he say, uh oh? But it's only two people fighting, and it's like everything is being affected. Did we know he was a Logia? I yeah. Yeah. How long you know he's a Logia? And when? Did they say it? Because they definitely didn't show it. Bro, they couldn't even hit him when they fought. Yeah, but that's like the same as Blackbeard getting hit, though. No, it's like on top actual... of you. And same thing with Magellan. He never did no, like, like, wait. Did he break into pieces when they fought? When he fought Luffy? Every time they, they just couldn't hit him. And he just used They weren't it. able to get close to him because he froze. No, all no, of no. Them. He punt every time they tried to punch him, they hit and it just got frostbite. That could still be like a like a non logia person though. I thought that was like a defense thing. He just let him hit him and then just freeze him. Not saying that he could have let it go through or every time I see a logia, it's like something gotta go through them. And it shows they um Right, like a Nero yeah. Ace, that type of stuff. Yeah. But I I don't remember uh, him unless he shattered. Okay. I don't know if he shattered when they fought. I don't remember him shattering. I definitely remember him always having like cold on him. But are you saying this now because we seen Magellan? He, he, well, mostly because like yeah. Before like, Magellan, did you think he was a Logia? Who? Ayokuji. I never sat there and thought about what he uh, was. Yeah. Oh. I just I just knew he was cold as hell. <laughs> that was it. I didn't know he was a Logia though until now, until he shattered. But maybe I forgot that he shattered when he fought Luffy. Yeah, I think we. I think the consensus was he was a Logia. I want to say because hmm. they was talking about Devil Fruits back then. He was like one of the. I'm absent-minded, y'all. 
I had to go back. So that that means the middle dude got to be a low gear then. Because Gizaru, I'm a low gear too? Yeah, but you know how old to be. I don't know. Oh, that's unnecessary. That's helping us. We got devil fruits. Ships can't move. True. That man trying to tell us something. <laughs> they did first. Destroy the Moby Dick. <laughs> <laughs> It's just so weird seeing these people go against Whitebeard, bro. This dude looking like, bro. <laughs> they ain't fed. Oh my god. Thank Ayoko G for the for the pathing. I hope he don't just take it back. Right. They all in the water. Dang, the girl is going crazy too. He run like somebody from Naruto. Dang, Mary. Oh, snap! It's going down. Dang, hey. Dang, stole on him. <laughs> he rocked him. It is literally an all out war right now. For real. Mm. He kind of made me a Drake a little bit because of his, because of his style. Mm. When is she going to learn? Put your glasses on. You fighting no glasses is still on <laughs> top of your head. Blind as heck. This dude. The Vice Admirals. Dang, it's like we finna go up the ladder. Oh shit, it's not Granny about to go crazy. What? It's like that? What's wrong with this dude's mouth? Squad pirates. Dang, Ace gotta be going through it, bro. Knowing he the reason for all of this. Whitebeard over there like... <laughs> <laughs> Stay still, Mihawk. Don't move, fam. Oh, my gosh. He talking? He talked. The true distance. Between your power? Oh, he trying to see where he's staying. Hawkeyes be looking for their prey. To cross swords with him. Mm. Zora already did it. Got mopped, but he did it. Right. The way he the way that sword came out, bro, the sound, bro. Oh lord. Yeah. Black sword knight. Yeah, because the edge of it kind of looked like the top of Blackbeard's, uh, the the top of Whitebeard's sword. He about to go at Whitebeard. You know he got that huge slash thing. Mm. Whitebeard about to be like, chill, boy. You you not on this level. Everybody looking like. <laughs> Might be probably still standing there. Oh, yo, dude. I ain't worried. <laughs> Big ball status. They all dude. I ain't worried. I ain't worried. But uh, it's dope to see like Mihawk actually kind of like try to be serious in a sense. We ain't seen that movie. We ain't never seen that. <laughs> Dang, they turn it up. Well, the Vice Admiral showed up. It's crazy how like they like not like Whitebeard, but like the um his sons and all of that, and mm -hmm. like even with the Navy, they're like coordinating their own attacks. You know what I'm saying? They just like yeah. all right, just shoot instead of like Sengoku saying. You do this, you do that. Or White Bear saying you do that. They just like. Just I like. It. I know some Goku knows more about what White Bear is capable of, but mm -hmm. it's kind of sad that that a, like a like a mere ten, technically normal rank person was like, "We got this, y'all." But Son Goku was like, "He can destroy everybody. <laughs> we might fail, but I'm just saying." <laughs> like I'm like, "Dang, bro, you got no confidence." He said he got the power to destroy the world, bro. If he wanted tremor, to. Tremor fruit. What you think about his devil fruit? I think it's fitting for him. Shake the world, man. That's crazy. This, like, I'm super excited about learning about the fruit. But now, me always thinking about the next step. I kind of want to see how much it can what do. What the heck, uh, Goldie Rogers' power is if he has a devil fruit. Mm -hmm. Um, what the heck is Rayleigh's uh devil fruit or or, or power? And what was somebody else? 
and dragons too. I'm trying to see what they stack up to Tremor Tremor Fruit and just Whitebeard's power overall. You know, mm-hmm. I feel like a lot of a lot of these high high profile players is strong in their own sense without even the devil fruit also. Mm-hmm. Like it's crazy. Yeah. This is dope, man. This is definitely dope. It's definitely heating up, man. Do you think Whitebeard gonna have to move from this from this move from from Mihawk? No. He can't move. He can't move. Otherwise it'll like hit the ship and destroy the ship. If he moves? Or if he evades it or something. So you think he's gonna stand there and hit and take it? I think he's gonna just um like repel it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Block it is what I think you're gonna do too. Yeah. You're gonna block it with that freaking with I don't know what that thing I don't know if I wanna call it a spear or whatever, but it seemed different than a spear. The blade is longer and it's curved, but I don't know what it is. This is crazy, bro. Ace, bro. Ace, bro. It ain't really like you said too. It ain't all Ace's fault. No. Blackbeard not. was the disloyal person that started everything. Mm-hmm. But you know then again, we also don't know what went down between Blackbeard and him. And All that, we seen was like, cause you know how they just show like, like, cause I feel like Oda like is doing that. Like Oda's making us not want to like Blackbeard, but we don't know what kind of went down. Like maybe Blackbeard went up to him, asked him nicely, and he just flicked him off or told him that I kill you. You know what I'm saying? We don't we don't really know what what happened because because I think Blackbeard said something along the lines like he was eye on that fruit first, but. Yeah, like no. we didn't we didn't see Blackbeard just we didn't see what see happened what between saying. them yet. I see what you're saying, and he was mad because I guess on Whitebeard's ship they mentioned that if you find it, then it's yours technically. Right, and Blackbeard didn't find it. We don't know that though. See what they saying? showed they showed because dude picked up the devil fruit and Blackbeard was looking like right, but like you don't know like where he found it. Blackbeard could have stored it somewhere. You see what I'm saying? He just he just did this. look what I found Ace just found it on the boat. See what I'm saying? Like we don't we don't truly know everything. Okay. Right now, it is definitely Blackbeard's fault. So are you justifying thing. Blackbeard killing Thatch? No no no. I just wait and I make sure I get the whole picture before I start assuming things. But right now, I think that it's Blackbeard had started it yeah. until we get the whole information of how Thatch found it, if mm-hmm. Thatch found it first, how he came about finding that fruit. And what happened between him and him, him and Blackbeard? What like Blackbeard came and asked him nicely or something like you know what I'm saying? We all, all we saw about, was an evil looking face by Blackbeard, and yeah. then Thatch was on the floor dead. No, I see what you're saying like that. That makes sense. Like they they just show some evil, make you think it's evil, but something yeah. else could. Pretty much like Among Us, you see somebody that's looking for somebody who just killed this person, yeah, and, and then you come up it. and I, you killed them. Like I didn't do nothing. But what about what about the fact that Blackbeard's plan? all along was to he was only searching for this fruit so that he could use it to become king of pirates and kill Whitebeard and all like that was his initial thought that started everything before they even found the devil fruit before they even got to that part where you had to figure out how they found it or how he killed Thatch he already had that like seed planted in his head that that's what like that was his true intention like everybody wanted to kill him even your boy until right. he came around. Right, but it's like he it was like Blackbeard was the one that like he everybody wanted to kill him, but Blackbeard was the one that when he what he tried to do started everything, in a sense, technically. From what it seems. Yeah. From what it seems. But I do want to give most of the credit that on Ace. I'm saying Blackbeard Because is of like, the decision he made not listening to Black to, yeah, uh, I'm not to saying Blackbeard. Blackbeard is more at fault. I mm-hmm. think Ace was more at fault. I'm just saying Blackbeard yeah. has some in that. I give him like 20%, and I'm putting 80% on Ace. It's definitely a crazy chain of events, the fact that something like this over over a devil fruit. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it, it's, uh, it's, it's definitely crazy how, like, a devil fruit started all of this stuff just happened right now. Yeah. Imple down. Freaking the war that's going on right now. Ace being locked up. Like, it started all of this. But... I feel like it also brought good things in a sense with like Yvonne being free, but I feel like he could have got free if he wanted to, yeah. he said. So yeah. I don't know. Maybe it ain't brought nothing good yet. <sighs> well, so far it's just this is just fire, bro. This is just yeah. fire. Especially Every learning. episode is just Yeah. Beautiful. And it's like they tying everything in, like like us finding out 
the ace is like Goldie Rogers' son. Yeah. 300 episodes ahead. You know what I'm saying? Just makes it like so much crazy. Like, just all the build up is starting to like come to fruition. Everything, mm-hmm. like the backstories, wild stuff is happening. Everything. It's just making it more, more hit harder. Mm-mm-mm. But this is dope, man. I'm ready to get to the next episode, see what happens. Same man. hip. Before we start, G, I ask you a question. I don't know why I'm laughing, but don't don't listen. Don't look at the laugh. I just want to know where you, where you got that headband from. It's my mama's. Well, why have you been? Did something special happen? You've been wearing her hat. You've been wearing her headband. I'm just around the house. Just, just around the house. Yes. Just decided to put it on. You know, can I I'm, wear it? You got your own hat. I Why you want to wear somebody else's hat? You know what they got. You just put on people's hats. You acting like <laughs> you, you acting like you're a stra- a stranger or something. Well, it's this it's this uh it's this uh episode of Kirby Enthusiasm. Mm. Where this dude is asking Larry for his glasses. He's like, hey, come here, give it to me. He's like, no, get away from me. <laughs> like, like, you trying to wear my glasses? It's probably a stranger. Don't you laughing at my mama's headband? No. You say you was about to laugh. No, I said, I know I'm, I don't know why I'm laughing right now, but I was like, don't pay attention to the laugh. Because you know how, like, 462 episodes of One Piece. And then out of nowhere, you come with a headband. I just noticed it different. And I was just trying to like bring it up. Did, have you not noticed the consistency of the random things I do? It's like blotches. It comes out sporadically random. The robe. I remember the robe. The, um, the Lilo and Stitch glasses. That was Lilo and Stitch? Never do that. I don't think so. It looked like that was a color scheme. It looked warm. That's why I was like, that's probably why. It's tight. It's, it's tight. It's tight on my head. Like, so, it's like at, at a tightness scale, it's about like one, I'm going to say about like a six. Mm-hmm. Like, I could rock it like this the whole day. I don't Just care, like you man. Got a, uh, uh, what's it called? Sizzle it. A, 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 a beep? A yeah. beep? But. A job? No, her job is that this the, the cover yeah. thing, right? Yeah, uh, I honestly don't know. No, it's a yamaka. Yamaka. <laughs> hey, but real talk, y'all never met like his parents, but his mom and his dad are like cool as freak, bro. Oh, they thank like, you. They like super cool. Your mom around. is cool too, and your dad, and your brothers, and your sisters. I don't know him, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they cool people, bro. But yeah, man. Um, that's why I asked to wear it. When she said it was your mom's, I was like, dang, that's cool. If it was just yours, I would have been like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, wear your mama's stuff. Exactly. What you look at me like that for? I'm about to say, let me wear your mama uh, t shirt. <laughs> you gonna wear your mama t shirt? No, it's just, it's just like. It's no way to explain this. No, it is. It's just okay. kind of sad in a sense. It's like, you know what I'm saying? Like, your mom, like, she actually, she going to come and help you. So, it means she has the opportunity to leave her stuff at your house. My mom, you know what I'm saying? She ain't been here. About to start crying. She supposed to come, y'all. She supposed to come. But yeah, I had to make it deep. I'm trying to watch white beards. <laughs> I wasn't gonna let it slide, but what she said, I no should just gave him the damn headband. <laughs> we had to go to. Nah, I'm just playing. No, yeah. You better force her, kidnap her, to tell her to come down here. I know she got a lot of kids, so tell her she won lottery ticket. Prank her and make a video, and make money off of it, and just say it's my fault. You can keep this recording and say that I forced you to do it. Okay, that way it's an easy out. I will take take on, you know what I'm saying? Whatever she got coming. Okay. As long as we make it. this money. 
Appreciate it. Yep, I helped set up everything. <sighs> Y'all want to have him comment down Operation Lottery Ticket <laughs> in the comments. My heart. Uh, I think I'm ready now. Oh, yeah, he was watching. Oh. But Oda does that. White Beard ain't even got to do nothing. He said, you're not even at my level yet. Just like a random dude stopping Mihawk attack. Is this one of his um his crewmates? Yo, I like this display, bro. I, I, that move, I like that. I see what kind of... I, I think that's what Oda kind of just did. The world's greatest swordsman. It's kind of like a showmanship, like... like you got warlords and, and stuff. I got people too. What's facts, good? Facts. Like, he had the move, bro. That's cold. He just sat there. What do you got? Diamond, diamond fruit? <laughs> that look like diamond. Diamond Jozu. What's his fruit? What's his fruit? Dang, they ain't gonna say it. Hey, that's a cold. Hey, that's a dope. Yeah, I ain't know he's sheep jacket, like bro. that. That's cold. Oh my God. That's cold. Uh, that's probably one of the codes I haven't seen. <laughs> that was cold. A marine always say what his devil fruit is. It didn't happen this time. Sengoku hands in his pocket, bro. You know, like how in the movies where the enemy like they be having the opportunity to to do the kill and they don't. Yeah. Like, I feel like they're showing, seeing Whitebeard show up. Why wouldn't they just, like, rush the execution or something? Or, like, just kill him? I've been thinking about that since we got the info down. I just ain't gonna say it. Because I felt like I'd be hating. But I wasn't really hating. I was really thinking the same way about you. But a lot of villains do do that. Like, yeah. they could have ended this whole situation. They could have just took the, the, the a blowback for, for uh, killing them. Yeah. Literally. But they was like, hey... We fight in three days. I mean, yeah, he died hours. in 24 hours. Four hours. You want the directions? We got seats available. <laughs> We're not going to hit them until 7 o'clock. <laughs> not, not, a, not a minute, but you know what I'm saying? Second after or before. 7 o'clock. That's it. Yeah. So they like, you really ask for this A whooping. That's yeah. all I'm saying. I don't know. About what? The A whooping? Huh? Oh. I'm, I'm just confused. saying. I mean, they gonna take the blowback no matter what because he was exactly. planning on executing them. He would have been gone the second we caught him. Yeah. And I would have just been like, we murked them. I would have been just mad as freak, but it's like, yeah. I'm just saying, like, why are they waiting? This this, this was no point unless Garp was fighting for him for 24 hours. Garp said, give me 24 hours and I'll save him. Bro, now I'm finna talk about Garp, bro. Team <laughs> Garp fail. Hey. You gotta have Garp, bro. I'm you gonna you gonna just like last couple times we die to people. You eventually come on along. It's fine. They have to do. I said that he had a chance to redeem himself. That's why I ain't worried. Brooke though. How you feel right now? You came around the brook. I'm saying you came I came around, around the, the Bonchon. I came around the Bonchon. Came you around the brook. Keep coming around because the stuff happens. That don't mean everybody. I'll be there before and I'll be like, just just get over here. Don't even wait. Come on, bro. You want to hold? Oh, I mean. How can you think him asking to see panties was like a good thing? I didn't think it was a good thing. I said, like, I valued him more than his Tourette's, whatever he got. I figured he, it was a, it was a reason behind that. And I, I, when I learned it wasn't, I already fell in love with his character. <laughs> <laughs> hey, go crazy, man. And the only person I missed was uh, the dude from... Uh, Kaku? No. Kaku. I like the Kaku. Yeah. Not as much as you. I don't I don't like Kaku like that. Not like I used to. <laughs> they broke up. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, hold on. I had something to say. What's the dude um who I thought was the villain with the mouse? What's his name? Oh, uh Iceberg? Yeah, I didn't think Iceberg was I thought he was gonna be a bad character. He was actually pretty cool. Yeah. I know, I know how that. You was him. wanting him to be bad so bad. Oh, the got me, hey. <laughs> he said, "Oh, the got me." You, you, so you come around too. But what you mean? I mean, yeah, that was one time. 
I'm saying but that's the only time because most of the time you always. I don't hate on him like side, you hate so. Garp right now. I just was suspicious. You got hate for Garp. Like I think I, I saw you before we started recording. You had a Garp little voodoo doll, and you was like poking it with pins, <laughs> and then you threw it under the desk when I walked in. <laughs> I think you saw that. I was like, I'm just saying. Okay, I was gonna say this right now. I know y'all ready to get to episode. Garp, I feel like, like I said last time, could have done more. From the flashbacks, all he did was dump Ace and Luffy off, left and go, did Navy stuff. And then gets mad when he reads out in the paper, oh, Ace became a pirate. That means you ain't been that close to him to understand or know what the freak he's been doing. Like, how are you teaching him? Or y'all saying he, how you, don't claim you their grandpa and stuff. And you care about them, and you don't do shiznits. Or you didn't really raise them like that. Like, have you, ever, have you ever grew up with people when you was younger, and their parents, like, try to, like, force stuff down in them? Or they just, like, too strict? Or they just, like, I don't, don't, don't do that. Don't do that. Like, they all, they usually end up the opposite. Most of them just bad at parenting, though, too. Like, yeah. you know, you got a lot of people with bad kids. They just bad as hell. You can't control them. And you they, always and they probably value, value other stuff than watching somebody's kids. Yeah, bad parenting, too. Mm-hmm. But it's like, bro, I don't feel like he did. I mean, that's they sh- then show some other stuff that Garp did or went through. But so far from what I've seen from the two or three flashbacks, his parenting style was not enough for them to not be pirates. Not saying that they, if he was there 100%. He would have still stopped them, but I'm just saying, don't be claiming you their grandpa and that you care about them and all of that stuff when you technically didn't try enough for me, from what I seen. To Ace or just to to Go Luffy? For him. Bro, he let Luffy go. He let Luffy go a lot of times. He, he let even... Luffy go one time. Was it twice? Twice. It was actually twice. He came back. But that's in a couple days. But the damage is already back. Luffy's already a pirate. You know what I'm saying? The damage is already done. I'm just saying, like, when it mattered, but for him to not be that way, he did. That's, like, like, that's like throwing a kid on somebody, and they like the president and stuff, and they gotta, they gotta now they gotta watch your kids. Right, but I'm just saying, don't claim, just don't claim to be their grandpa then, or be their family if you don't really feel that. If you, you know what I'm saying, don't really feel that way. I think it's more so you're mad at the fact that he's not fighting fighting for Ace as much as Whitebeard is. I mean, before Whitebeard even showed up, I was... Even when they was talking to Goldie Roger in the cave, I was just like, bro, I'm tired of Gart. Like, it's been going on before White. When Whitebeard showed up, it was icing on the cake, bro. Like, he fight for Ace, and Ace is doing stupid stuff. He took all his freaking burden, bro. That's how a father is supposed to treat their motherfucking son, bro. That's not his father. I'm saying, like, don't claim to be his grandpa or nothing like that if you ain't finna be fighting for him. That's all I'm saying. I think you may need more information. That's why I said, unless they showing us something that... I That's why know. I don't be, like, trying to... I kind of wait now, because, like, I, 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 I used to jump all the time. Jumping. I'm lowering my theory uh, account. <laughs> Yo, why is you? Really, bro? Yo. <laughs> hey. Hey, I'm just saying. You ready? Mm-hmm. Oh, now you're giving out orders after everybody started already? They ain't doing nothing. They dodging like a mug. That's... Oh, he, oh, I'm about to say that's still up. Uh, please stay seated. Oh my gosh. First it was Ayokichi. He ain't got up. Yeah, he like, I get up when I need to. Minimum damage. Oh. He think he finna kill Whitebeard? Oh my God, bro. Solar Flare. <laughs> It's so bright. That's the dude on Marco. On white... I think that's Marco. Yes, sir. 
Did he die? Yeah, I didn't think he was that strong to ward off like an attack like that. Like he got fried. This man is uh the human torch. Can't reach the king. Damn, look cold so easily. I don't like how you got blue flames, bro. Blue flames is hotter than regular flames. Can't be colder than ace. He got wings. What mythical creature? <laughs> what type of devil fruit is this? So this is yo. Fiend Zapdos? No, no, no. What, 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 what's uh, the fire one called? Uh, Moltres. Moltres. He can bring back the attack that he absorbed. Do the same attack? It didn't work the first time. He just like, bro. <laughs> he was like, bro, what are you doing? Yo, they get the cracker. Don't lie. What is Kazaru? What just happened to Kazaru? The delayed attack? Oh, did he push back the attack? I knew that you wouldn't let me. Okay. Yo, White Beard got some ballers, This dude bro. is fighting Kazaru, bro. This dude's strong as heck, bro. <laughs> get out. Let's get out of here. He's not about to pick this up, though. Yo. They having to stare off. I'm like, yeah. Who forces better? Oh. This man just threw a glacier at them? Ooh, I didn't know it was that big. Pause. That was an ice planetary devastation, fam. With his hands. Oh, dang. Uh, uh, Kai, oh, he's about, about to do, do something. something. Don't cut off. Don't cut off. Okay, yeah. cool, cool, cool. I'm about to say, man. Yeah, they be on dirt. All three admirals about to be on. Yo, Marco? That sound like a whole airplane taking off. He like, yeah. That lava? What the heck? It's been like mag magmar. This man is like a volcano, fam. Dang, man, them three admirals. Plus an attack afterwards. Oh my god! How godly is this? Dang. I don't know what to say right now. There's too much going on right now. Promise you. Dang, they knocked one of the ships? I forgot this on display. It's like some My Hero shit. That... Get the f <laughs> Wife here! Yo, what the freak? Me, he blew his ass <laughs> out, bro. Dang. But the case is still you mag must squirt. Mag must squirt. Oh, heck you know. Like me. That was cold. Oh, my that gosh. It's crazy how Sengoku was scared of Whitebeard, but all the admirals be thinking that they can touch him. Yeah. That was cold, bro. He just cut. Dang, he cut that. Mm. <laughs> Who is it's this crazy. Guy? All these people showed up, man. Yeah. What the hell? That was nasty. Usopp, you better learn. <laughs> Sink the Moby Dick. <laughs> they silly. Hey. Co I was about to say Kobe out there, bro. Bro, please. Kobe, Kobe about to probably mop some people though. Hey, it's like his first war. Kobe, no. Kobe, just just go back. 
Why didn't even let y'all out there? Hey, bro. Gark treated them two better than Ace and Luffy. Uh, Kobe become an admiral one day, bro. Now that we know the strength of him, he can't. He can't. He can't run. Yeah. If, if he ever want to do that, he can't run right now. Is White Beard about to show his giants because they already showed theirs? What the heck is that? They about to end. Dang. Oh, it's his orange, though. Or Might red. be like his brother or something. <laughs> or his head family. Hey. That's definitely a build up. Wherever Oris came from. Look at it. School. Little Oris Jr. <laughs> what? Oris Jr. Is that his daughter? He had like eyelashes and stuff. He said Junior. George Junior. He's way bigger. You can't name a female Junior? <laughs> Oh yeah, they would show Moria. Oh, here he go. <laughs> Little Orange Junior. Whitebeard is pulling out all the freaking stuff, bro. For real, bro. This jump was crazy. Uh, <sighs> oh boy. The diamond dude deflected me. Hawk attack. Freaking Marco the Phoenix fighting Kazaru. Just think about Kazaru when he first showed up. Nobody in the, could touch him, bro. But Marco by himself. Defending off his attacks and everything. Pushing them back. Yeah, I think Marco was that, was that nice. There's some strong people out there, man. Yeah. Strong people. Um, But what stole the show for me this episode was Whitebeard stopping the magma rock and blowing the shit out. He paid for that. He's like, bro, this can't touch me, bro. Like, that stuff was dominant. That was domination right there, bro. He paid for that one. <laughs> yeah. I'm ready for the next set, though. Oh, snap, bro. He, 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 he ain't gonna talk about it, V. I ain't got nothing else to say. You right. said everything. Uh, I mean, what you mean? That was pretty much the, the, uh, the whole thing. I'm ready for the next set. Alright, let's get to the next episode. Oris Jr. Well, how did he get? He swam? Mihawk ain't even phased. They, ain't, they don't seem phased at all. <laughs> Stole off of him. Dang! What is disregarding these mugs? Bro, this is a war. That's what she said. He's still a human being. He's like, man, they bringing this crazy stuff here, man. In my yard. I'll slam it on the other ship. Dang. Yeah, we causing havoc in this motherfucker. But now I feel like the pirates is, is kind of got the upper hand right now. Yeah. But I feel like it's going to be switching. Kobe, just get out of there. They kind of remind me of uh, Kainu and, and Ayokoji, those two. Mm. Oh, I can see that. Yeah. They look just like so weird. Dang, sword. Dang, I thought somebody was gonna come in and stop it. He call them pops. I be like, I be trying to tell y'all, bro. The fact that he talking like that, just normal conversations, is crazy, bro. 
Dude, White Beard, dude, White Beard didn't know he was coming. From that conversation, uh -huh. it sounded like he was like, oh. Mm, she gone. Bang. <laughs> First dude, I got you. <laughs> help, help. Somebody get us something. <laughs> Hey, don't talk to Boa, bro. Oh, snap! Whatever she touch? Dang! Boa, I didn't know it was like that! She hitting everybody. Yo, Boa cold as freak! Hey. So that cheap? Oh, she hit Navy soldiers too? Dang. <laughs> All right, I mean, the, the, the Luffy better be careful. <laughs> oh, man, I want him to break Ace loose, bruh. About to send ours to another freaking planet, bro. Dang, man. If Kuma just paid, just mind his business, bro, we could have probably got him quicker. Just mind your business. You literally just helped us. Just mind your business on this one. Uh, that thing gone, bro. Kuma ain't gonna beat it up, though. Huh? He's not gonna beat or Jr. up, though. I seen Moria hop back. And he got the freaking sound. God dang. Oars! Come on, bro. You don't see this? What are you looking at? I would have sliced at him so. I don't think he's paying attention. It's a damn nuke. And he stopped. Dang. He was right there. Oh my gosh. He ate that. Dang, he bleeding. It's gonna regain consciousness. And we just got Ors Jr., bro. Mmm. <laughs> Dang. The Wano Kingdom? That's the second time they talked about it with the samurai. Yeah. Man, he gave him a hat, bro. Dang, bro. He said it's cool on you. Yo, cover oars, man. Oh, whoa, whoa. Mm. I, I, I gotta say, that's cold as hell that he just floated like that, bro. <laughs> this man gave him the perfect gift. Oh, shit. Bro, can always get some help? Bro, he just sliced his foot off. Just when you thought the Flamingo was all puppet. This man's durable, bro. He's like, if I could just get some of these soldiers. Oh, he's still trying to reach. He gonna cut his arm off, G. Bro, he about to cut his arm off. Bro, that's crazy, bro. Dang, he got that close. What if he grabbed them and threw them to Whitebeard and they took the chains off? I know oh, that ain't gonna happen. I know that ain't gonna happen, but. Why are you taking a dump or something? I ain't on the low. Okay. To think that Little Ors Jr. will have this much of an impact to this war. Yeah, for sure. I thought it was just a cameo. Dang, bro.
Like, oh snap, Little Wars Jr. showed up. Not that he about to get some freaking damn near chopper treatment to me. For real. Last time, man, that was crazy. Freaking do flamingo, bro. Sliced this goddamn foot, bro. The way he jumped up though, did that was cold. Thank you, bro. I thought he was all puppet, bro. I was kind of happy. You thought he was like weak or something? I mean, I ain't think that his ability was gonna be like that useful. I think he was weak, but that's that crazy. Boa went crazy. You know, I didn't know she was like acrobatic like that. That uh, was wild too. Everybody was showing some stuff that we didn't know they had. Yeah. Dang, I like the flashback though with Ace and Oak, with Oris Jr. Yeah, that was that was cool. Ah oh, man, it's too much, man. Luffy ain't even showed up yet. It's too much, man. I just need Ace to get saved so he can start wrecking havoc, bro. But you know he' about to go crazy. Freak. You got any uh, any more remarks, man? See y'all next time. Dope episode. Hope y'all enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure y'all check these videos out on our Patreon before we put them on YouTube. Facts. Double dragon out. Peace. Deuces.